This is the first time in over 10 years of making videos that I'm actually making a video on someone else who's on the internet. And it's not something I usually do. And I decided to make this video not because I agree with what Goggins preaches, and I do agree 100%. I agree with his message. But because he genuinely cares. He actually cares about people. He actually cares about helping his audience. And I think that is rare. Okay, that is, that is extremely rare. I kind of emphasize how rare that is. You know, as a content creator, you see the content that other people put out on the internet. And you can tell right away when it's real. You can tell if they are really trying to help you or they are just trying to get views. And there's nothing wrong with getting views. Obviously, that's a big goal, right? Because if no one watches your content, then you can't spread your message. But Goggins is real. Goggins is genuine or genuine. Sorry, English is not my my first language. And if you don't know who he is, he's a former Navy SEAL. I'll leave a, a link to his Instagram in the description of this video. I made a list of a couple reasons why I think Goggins is a good place to go for advice. If you are struggling with anything in life, I think Goggins has a good message. He does use a lot of profanity, which I won't use, I try to keep this channel you know, G-rated because there are some people, not many, but there are some people who are in high school who watch my content. It's mostly, mostly 18 and up. So I made a list, I've got five reasons and I'm just gonna go through it uh, in this video. So the first one I've already talked about, it's that he actually cares. You know, it's hard to find good advice that's solid, that's also coming from someone who is actually trying to help people in the world. I mean, that is his mission. His purpose in life is to inspire people. And I just have so much respect for that. It, it is rare. I can't, again, I can't emphasize how hard it is to find influencers who actually care. I mean, that is, that is epic, my friends. That is so hard to find, so hard. I'm getting goosebumps. Just very, very hard. So it's not just about his message. It's about his intentions. That's, that's the first point I wanna make. The second thing is that, yeah, he's giving real advice. You know, he's giving things that you can actually use. It's not like this weird, complicated stuff, you know? He's giving advice that people, anyone from all walks of life can listen to and use, and you can better your life in every way. Most of his stuff is, you know, fitness stuff, and you know, training and all that stuff, stay hard, you know? Who's gonna carry the boats and the logs? You know what I'm talking about. But it's real, right? It's real advice. And he does it in a way that is like unfiltered. He tells people what they need to do. He calls them out. And that's brave, right? That's brave. He does not hold back. He does not hold back. His message is a good one. So he says that, and this is something we can all relate to here. This is a math channel after all. Growth comes from doing hard things. So the general philosophy of Goggins, and please correct me if I'm wrong, is that you become stronger by doing hard things. And as a math channel, that 100% resonates with my message, right? I mean, if you get up every single morning, right, and you do mathematics, or you go for a run, or you go to the gym, and you make it a routine, and and you get up when you don't want to get up, right? You build that discipline. You realize that some days are going to be harder than others, but you push through it. That builds strength. And that strength builds confidence and builds perseverance. And it will certainly 100%, my friends, carry over to other areas of your life. And Goggins knows that. And he's preaching that. And I think that's epic. 
It's a great message to send out to everyone who is studying anything hard in college. If you're studying engineering, computer science, anything. The message that Goggins sends applies directly to you, but to your studies instead. And I think that needs to be said. And if, if you already have a math degree, if you already have a PhD in math, if you've already done it, if you already have an engineering degree, you know how hard it is. You know how hard you had to work. It's no joke. And I think a lot of people who don't study these hard things, they don't understand. But when you hear Goggins talk about the pain and how it builds strength, it makes sense. He understands, but from a different perspective, from a physical perspective. The mind is the most powerful thing you have. And even Goggins says it. If you can control your mind, you got it. And he says so many positive things that I've actually said on my channel. And then some, you know, I'm on Instagram and I'll see a reel. I'm like, whoa, this is the same message that I was sending, but in a different context. And that's, that just really, really resonates with me. So it's a very powerful thing. The fourth one is that, you know, he tells it how it is. Most people can't handle the truth, right? It is on you. It is on you to succeed. It's on nobody else. You can't blame other people for your success. You have to take responsibility. You have to take action. And I've told the story again, so I'll tell it quickly, but when I went to college, my very first class, I mean, I, I didn't even have a high school diploma. I was a dropout, right? And I took a programming class and I felt like a rock star because I taught myself how to code in C, you know, with no education at all. And uh, I told myself that my success would depend only on me. And I made that my mission the entire time. I made it my mission to not rely on others. I made it my mission to take responsibility for my success. I made it my mission to not seek any validation from my teachers. I made it my mission to be 100% independent and crush it. And did I? I mean, I didn't get a 4.0. It was like a 3.8 something. And then in grad school, it was like a 3.9. So I got better in grad school, go figure. But take responsibility. Don't blame other people for anything. Sometimes things are unfair. That is life. You have to be resourceful, you have to rise above, and you have to crush it. Crush it. The last one is his mindset is a cheat code for life. Yeah. Yeah, if you, if you adopt the, the Goggins mindset, which is, again, you do hard things every day, it makes you stronger, you get better at doing more hard things so that when you face adversity in life, because we all face adversity, we all do, you're able to use that strength and apply it to other areas of life, whether it be relationships, academics, physical fitness, applying for a job, hard things like public speaking, anything, right? Anything you want to do in life, when you do hard things, it makes you tougher. It's about being tough, right? And you build that physical and mental resilience through routines and, and doing it you know, over and over again. David Goggins, great, great influencer. Um, and again, it's because he's real, right? That's, that's the part I respect. And also his message is great. He's not preaching negative things. You know, there are some things like on Instagram especially uh, where you know, influencers will, will talk about things and they're a little bit negative. I don't necessarily agree with some of them. Um, but Goggins, Goggins is real. Yeah, what do you think about Goggins? Do you even know who he is? I don't know if this video uh, will, will get a lot of views, right? I'll be talking about views because most influencers, they do want to get views, but I don't know if, if this particular channel is the right place for this, but I do think that, I do think it applies so much, so much, my friends, because mathematics is like one of the hardest things you can do, right? I used to tell myself, you know, this is kind of random, but when I taught myself how to code in C, I told myself, well, if I can teach myself how to code in C, I can do anything. That was my, that was my mentality, you know, and I was a big fan of, uh, uh, I don't know if you've heard of him, Linus Torvalds, he's the guy who created Linux. I used to watch his documentaries and I was like, oh, Linux, you know, he created the Linux kernel and, you know, I was just so enthralled with coding and I thought, if I can do this, 
I can do anything, right? And then I discovered math accidentally, which I guess people say is harder than CS. <laughs> I don't know. I liked it a lot more. I liked it. I liked mathematics more than the coding. I like using a pencil, even though I, I'm still always on the internet. You know, I make videos now. But yeah, David Goggins, real advice for real people. I have a bunch of books, by the way. They're math books. Check out the links in the description. But and courses. They're on Udemy. Use the links from my website, mathsorcerer.com. But, but, there's something even better than all that that's kind of related to this video. And this is a little bit different than the message Goggins preaches. Um, Goggins doesn't really talk about this. Goggins doesn't mention this. It's about taking action. So my message is that if you want to do anything in life, what's, it's very similar to Goggins, you have to do it. You have to take action. You have to be responsible. And action, logically speaking, if you're trying to do anything, Action is the one thing you can do, right? Like if you want to apply for a job, you actually have to apply for the job. If you want to get in shape, you actually have to go to the gym. If you want to study math, you actually have to do mathematics. So developing the ability to take action is the most powerful thing you can do on this earth. Because if you can take action, you can accomplish anything in the world. And so I wrote an entire book on it. It's called Real Superpowers That Will Change Your Life. And it gives you things that you can use to help you take action in life. And yeah, I'm very happy with this book. Um, highly recommend it. You can read the whole thing in a day. Put it on your kitchen table if you're having a hard day, if you're just if you're feeling flustered, if you're feeling like you can't focus and you want and you want to take action, you want to work, pick up the book, open it to any chapter, the first six or seven are the best, and it'll give you tips for taking action. Things you can use to change your life, to learn math, get in shape, or whatever. But anyways, Goggins. Great, great influencer. And I say that not only because his message is good, but because he is genuine or genuine. I gotta, I gotta learn the correct way to say that. He's actually real. You know, he, he's actually real. He's actually preaching good things. And he has good intentions. You know, he has good intentions. And it's kind of a random video. It's my first video about someone else. I usually, I usually don't do this because I don't know. I don't like talking about other people. I just, it's just not something I do. I've just never done it. So anyways, as always, my friends, stay strong. And if you're from my other channel in Spanish, sigue luchando.